Hi, my name is Kyle Mishulis of Non-Polynomial Labs, and today I'm here at Subatron at the Museum's Quartier in Vienna, showing off my, or one of my projects for Robo Exotica 2009, which is Adult Mario. Adult Mario is an interactive, immersive version of Mario that also serves you alcohol. So taking a closer look at the bot here, we have the drinks, which are inside these Tetris pieces here. And down from the drinks, we have the Nintendo, which the tubes run through. Inside the Nintendo, there are little servos that compress the tubes and uh, let them go in order to let the drinks flow. And the drinks come out back there and back to these cups right here. At the moment, it's currently serving cherry coke, but at Robo Exotica, we'll have it serving rum, coke, and water. So to give you a little tour of the immersive part of the installation, we're currently using a Philips AmbiX system using the Lib AmbiX drivers written by Non-Polynomial Labs. Um, it, we have lights, fans, and even a trance vibrator set up in order to create a more immersive experience for the player so that they can really feel what Mario is feeling as they play the game. Moving on to emulation. We're using the FCEUX emulator with the Lua scripting engine behind it in order to access our uh, hardware. The Lua script actually uses open sound control to talk to a Python server that is running all of the hardware threads and manages opening and closing the valves, turning off, on and off the lights, moving the fans, and making the vibrator vibrate. So now we will move on to what the game is. To play adult Mario, all you do is play Mario Brothers. Making Mario run faster makes the fans blow at the player so that they can actually feel the wind in Mario's face as he runs. Jumping on an enemy causes the lights to turn red for a second and for the player to be served a small bit of rum. Um, otherwise, the lights are matched to the color of the sky. Getting a coin causes the player to be served a small bit of coke. Finally, there's the flagpole. The flagpole triggers the trance vibrator, and the higher that you get on the flagpole, triggers the um, sets the, sa the time that the vibrator vibrates. So you can actually feel Mario sliding down the flagpole. You also get rum for as long as he is sliding down the flagpole. So at the end, you've gotten an immersive experience and alcohol. What more could you ask for?